I'm Mark Batson with Tongue and Groove Design Build in Wilmington, North Carolina. And we're in the idyllic neighborhood called Summer Rest, which is just on the outskirts of Wrightsville Beach. It's a neighborhood where everyone seems to be friends here. And they do this thing that's called porch time, which is simply neighbors walking over to neighbors' houses, having drinks and socializing. Sort of the old south way of living. Big old growth oak trees, Spanish moss, balmy sea breezes washing in, and just strolling over your neighbor's house with a glass of wine. The fun part of this project, and in the spirit of the community, we wanted to create a space that amplified these ideals of better living. Positioned on a long, narrow lot, we wanted to create a public front porch space, a rocking chair front porch, but also in the rear, create an enclave for the client to be able to get away. So the long shotgun style home comprised of three garage bays, a breezeway, and then an entry into the mudroom laundry. Sort of creates a modified shotgun type effect. So we're in the laundry room, doggy door, study, powder bath, and then spilling into the kitchen, dining, living, bar area, and then folding door, window, blurring the line between indoor and outdoor space, which makes a modest size home live a lot bigger. The overall concept for this home was first floor living for the five inhabitants, two of which are only human. And then the secondary rooms are upstairs for guests. But in the great room area, we still wanted the illusion or the feel of a lot of space. So we vaulted the great room and we added a ridge skylight to drop natural light so that for the majority of the day, you don't have to turn your lights on. Of course, we're under construction still, but at least you can see the way that we separate the indoor and the outdoor spaces with this folding door and folding window unit, which opens across a bar that the kitchen feeds out of. We've got a gracious rear patio with four cheaters and phantom screens, and then it spills out onto the pool deck. Along with the privacy fence, we built uh, a planter along the full perimeter of the property that allow for not only seasonal flowers, but vegetable garden. The porch spills out into a large turfed area, which will easily accommodate the three dogs. So stay tuned for the next chapter as this house comes to a conclusion in the next few months.